And our final competitor here, trains out in Minnesota, was a graduate of the University of Minnesota and now runs for Brooks. I want you to welcome her and also know that twice Gabe has been diagnosed with cancer, fought and won, and is now one of the best runners in the world. Please welcome her here at the Flow Track Throwdown. You know, really, it kind of crystallizes everything and just kind of, it changes your perspective so much. When I was sitting at home and, you know, going through my treatment and had to end my season, and the biggest thing that got me through that was the possibility of, you know, returning for one more season and, you know, having a good season and kind of showing what the human spirit can do. But I'm so grateful that I had the chance to come back and run and, you know, put that energy and those emotions into something like running. And here comes Fuentes. But Grunwald swings wide. She's in lane three, and she's digging Sefuentes with a slight edge. Grunwald digging Sefuentes, but here comes Grunwald in the last 20 to nail the A standard and run 15-19. People say that you should try to run every race like it's your last, and I guess I kind of had an opportunity to do that. Gabe Anderson, known to have a big kick. Here she comes. Whoa. And oh, watch out. From behind, out kick the number one ranked 2011 1500 meter runner. It just means a lot to still stay connected to the sport. Even if I can't like be fully diving in, like I'm keeping my feet wet and like hopefully that'll help me. If there's an opportunity for me to come back and be competitive, like I feel like this year will help me just get ready for another opportunity to actually run fast. I think for me, it's been a, it's been a tough journey. It's been a, a life I didn't expect. Still happy to be racing and just happy to be feeling good and um, happy to be out here. <laughs>